Hello and welcome to IO Live. I'm Timothy Jordan and I'm standing here with Tim Sneath, a product manager on Flutter. Hi, Tim. Hi, Timothy. How are you doing? I'm doing very well, thank you. Let's talk about Flutter. Yeah. For those few developers out there that don't know what Flutter is yet, what is it? Yeah, so Flutter is a toolkit for building native mobile apps for iOS or Android from the same code base. It's open, it's uh, open source, and uh, today at IO we're announcing a new version of Flutter. Oh, yeah, so that was my next question. What's ah. new this week? There's a new version, what else? Yeah, so to this week we're announcing Beta 3. Uh, obviously, it's the third beta of our product. Uh, we shipped uh, the first beta at Mobile World Congress a couple of months ago, and now we're starting to get to the point where we really feel like it's ready for a lot of production use, and so we're encouraging people to start taking a look at Flutter. Now, you've worked with developers using Flutter a lot. What would you say they're most excited about when they start using Flutter? Yeah, so I think there are three things primarily that make Flutter a great platform for building apps. Number one, uh, we have native performance. We, sh we compile everything that you write to ARM code. We're powered by the Dart programming language, and that enables this really fast performance. Uh, second thing is we have this unrivaled productivity. Uh, with Flutter, you can use this thing called Hot Reload, so you can uh, write your code, you can continue to work with it, and see exactly the changes that you're making in real time on the device. And then thirdly, Flutter has this high velocity uh, graphics engine that lets your dreams come true, lets uh, designers choose what they want to build and developers put them into production. Awesome, and there's a lot of people using Flutter today. What are some of your highlights of the apps that are out and live? Yeah, so again, we've only just uh, got into beta over the last couple of months. Uh, we've had a few great applications that have come out, uh, both internally at Google and externally. Uh, internally, well, we power some things like our ads. Uh, if you uh, ever create an ad campaign, you're using a Google app uh, built with uh, Flutter. Uh, externally, uh, probably the most famous one that uh, was shipped uh, the back end of last year was uh, Hamilton. You know the Broadway uh, musical. They shipped a companion app for uh, using Flutter that has had millions of downloads, really great application. And then this week we're talking about some other uh, new apps. Alibaba, the big Chinese online retailer, they've just shipped an app in Flutter that they're now rolling out to millions of customers. Uh, Groupon have an app that they're working on. Uh, we have just different kinds of apps from different industries. Wine, retail, finance, loads of different people are, are coming out with apps. And in fact, we've just seen several hundred apps just since we shipped beta go live on the Play Store. If you want to get started with Flutter, what's your first step? Well, uh, there's one simple place you can go, and that's flutter.io. And there you can find sessions, you can find code labs. We're obviously live streaming six different sessions here at Google this week. Uh, there's a whole bunch of documentation, and of course you can download the Flutter SDK. And that's all at flutter.io. Flutter.io. <laughs> Thank you, Tim. Of course, it's a pleasure. I'm Timothy Jordan, and this is IO Live.